Hello YouTube, this is Rom Tech with another episode of Battlefield 4 Multiplayer. Today we're going to head into uh, a little domination match on uh, the map. The M Dawnbreaker, there we go. That's a nice map. Uh, I've played it a couple times. Actually, there's just way too many rooms. And when it's not a room, it's long range. So I'm going to go ahead and try Assault for the first few minutes and then we'll see if we can head into Engineer because I unlocked the AK-5C and that is an amazing gun to deal with. It's it's great. Low recoil, everything. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. Feeling a little under the weather. So uh, let's just... Okay. Yeah, just got killed there. So, uh... Yeah. Um... It's so, alright. Let's just get respawned back in here. Alright. Let's see if we can catch someone. Oh, there we go. Ah, he's dead. Old news. He's old news. Alright, let's go and find someone else. Oh yeah, guys. On, on another note, is uh, anyone excited for any of these uh, 2014 PS4 games? Because I know I am. Uh, I'm waiting for uh, Watch Dogs, really, and The Crew, that racing game. Watch Dogs is like a... It's an open world game. It's uh, uh, it, it looks really good. And uh, the game was supposed to come out with the PS4. Uh, launch date, but it didn't, so it was delayed. Uh, I was pretty sad, but it, it, th this shows that the game developer is putting a bit more effort into the game, so that's a much more stable experience that we're gonna enjoy. Um, yeah, so anyone, uh, anyone excited for Infamous Second Son? Uh, that's a pretty good game, but I don't plan on buying it, unfortunately. What I do plan on buying is the Watch Dogs and the Crew, which is an open world racing game. Uh, it, it's like, it, it, it's different because it puts players in like massive persistent like sandbox and like it's huge. It's, it's not even like pertainable. The game will, it's like it puts players in a virtual United States uh, where you can actually drive across the country from coast to coast. It, 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 that takes 90 minutes in the game, apparently. If you're, if you like racing titles and this doesn't like touch your interests, I, I really don't know what to tell you because that is really, really awesome. I just never seen anything like it. Uh, another, another thing, it, it's kind of to rival Forza, but that's Drive Club. I don't know. I'm not into the driving simulation. I'm into the like real on racing because simulation is just, it's not fun enough. Destiny is also another game I'm planning to buy. Um, it, it's really cool. It's uh, it's a next gen like MMORPG FPS. So a, a lot of people were paying attention to it, but it's it's sort of like a I don't know how to explain it. It's uh, um, it's like it's like Halo. The the people behind Halo got in and made but and made Destiny. So, it, it's gonna. It's supposed to come in September 2014. I know it's a long way, but it, it's supposed to put players in like a a post-apocalyptic open world. So in like a, a sci-fi kind of setting. So it, it, it's nice, and it uh, it shows you something familiar, but it's it's completely new. It's really cool. Um, and when you consider the fact that uh, this title, like. Uh, also features like really nice graphics and the gameplay and the story is just awesome. I got to test it out, but it's it's really cool, and it, it, I really like it. I don't see why anybody is, could hate Destiny. It's a, it's a great thing. So um, yeah, th those are the games I'm excited about: uh, The Crew, Watch Dogs, and Destiny. Those those are Watch Dogs is like a a GTA, Assassin's Creed, all teched up and stuff and 
Destiny is like a Halo kill zone kind of thing. And the crew is just amazing. It's like, it's really realistic and it's just awesome. I'm waiting for those games. I know, I'm really excited. So, uh, uh, recently actually, Sony has been trying to get, um, uh, they, they've gotten patent deals with uh, adding new content to emulated games. So basically what emulated games are is you're playing a game on a console that belongs to another console, usually. So the, Sony is just saying that it's trying to find new ways to play already existing video games so they can, in, you know, increase the longevity of the new, uh, the older ones. Oh, he, oh, he used a rocket launcher. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead. Yeah, I died. So basically, instead of playing the same level or uh, playing the same missions repeatedly, gamers, you can, like, desire new challenges when replacing legacy games. So game designers at, like by Sony have begun to produce like mini games that you can play so you can be instructed to like complete new objectives or challenge friends or you know it's pretty cool and the, the patent uh, let me look up its name real quick it's called the suspending state of cloud-based legacy applications that's what Sony's patent is called so that that's basically gonna be really nice because I don't know, and the the release of uh, Gaikai, that online game streaming service in uh, early 2014, that's going to be really fun because you can stream games from other consoles and you can just rent them. It's going to be like a, a Netflix for games kind of thing, but you also you stream it. You don't actually hold the disc or download the game. It's streaming, so you're going to need a pretty good internet connection for something like that if you don't want any lag at all. I know mine's at like 300 megabits per second, but I have to pull like an ethernet cable all the way from the router. I don't know, it's, it's pretty fast. Uh, oh my god, there's a lot of people here. Okay, wait, wait, let me go close. Okay, that guy just died in front of me. Kill him. <coughs> Sorry, guys. All right, let's go check for more. I'm hungry, I'm hungry. All I'm getting is assists. I ain't full yet. Oh, he threw a grenade. Oh, that guy's about to die. That guy's about to... No. No, never mind. Oh, oh I saw... He's on... He's right there. Oh, no, no, no. I messed up. I messed up. Sorry, guys. Really sorry. So, uh... Another thing is that... You, did you guys know Japan, like... Their first PlayStation 4 commercial... Uh... It arrived. So... That's really funny because... We've been playing with our PS4s for, like... Months and their first commercial just arrived and it talks about like American places too it's like New York Sydney I, I don't know it's it's it talks about London and, yeah it, Paris it, it shows all basically the launches and it's just leads up to Japan's launch so you know Japanese people would be excited I'm guessing <laughs> Yeah, so, guys, if you guys comment with anything uh, you're waiting for or excited about, oh, I just got this camper, look at him. Yeah, just just comment with suggestions. If you want me to try out new games, just tell me. I know I, I will be uploading some uh, gameplays of uh, Blacklight Retribution, which is the free-to-play game. It's a it's a first-person shooter. It's in beta, but it's, it's, a, it's pretty nice for, like, it's time. And the price, I mean, it's free. I will be uploading some Resogun gameplay for you guys, but Resogun tends to take a little longer than Battlefield, actually, so... Th those videos will be a little longer, but I guess they'll be worth it in the long run. Um, if you guys want me to upload some contrast, I can do that, too. Just comment and let me know below. Uh, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, I will definitely be posting some gameplays. Uh, m mostly just, like, a montage or... You know, individual ones where I, you know, do something really cool and want to show you guys. Um, but that's about it. Uh, make sure you guys go uh, go to uh, Infamous Gaming's channel. Uh, I'll put it down in the description. When you search it on YouTube, it's it's the second one that comes up. Yeah, it's not the first one. Not the one with the Black Ops 2 profile picture. No. Yeah, make sure to check out his videos too. Uh, sometimes we'll do dual commentaries like... Uh, 
yesterday or the last video. And so, uh, yeah, it'll, it'll be fun. Um, just, 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 you know, like if you uh, want to continue the series. Uh, subscribe so you never miss a video. Uh, thumbs up to let me know that it was good and everything. And just keep up with me. I'll uh, make sure to read the comments and reply to you guys that, you know, ask questions. Um, yeah, so if you, if you have problems with your PS4 at all, you can comment that below too. Uh, I will definitely have some answers and solutions and stuff. So just, yeah, just go ahead. Uh, talk to me, guys. Alright, this is... What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to stop the commentary from now on. So I'll just let the gameplay run until it's over. You guys can watch that, but I'm going to stop talking from now on so I can focus a little more. So, uh, see you guys next episode, and uh, I hope you enjoy this gameplay. Uh, make sure to subscribe, you know, uh, follow me on Twitter at RomTech. I uh, keep up with everything, don't worry, I'll follow back. <laughs> I post my news and Twitch updates and all that on there. You can go ahead and check out my Twitch too, it's RomTech as well. Uh, but that's about it. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, see you next episode.
This is the objective I want you to attack. 